Hey friends, welcome to my kitchen. I'm Rhonda and this is a little bit of everything homestead. Today we are going to make a super easy bread recipe to go along with some chili that I have cooking on the stove for dinner tonight. You're going to throw all the ingredients except for the butter into a bowl and combine. So it calls for three cups of all purpose flour, three teaspoons of baking powder, and one teaspoon of salt, a fourth cup of sugar, and then we are just going to grab a fork and we are just going to mix this to combine all your dry ingredients and then you take a beer a 12 ounce can of beer any kind of beer that you have sitting around the house it doesn't need to be anything special and mix it in and flavor it up you're just going to stir in the beer to your dry ingredients and it's going to be like a raggedy dough Keep mixing until all of the flour is incorporated. It is nothing fancy. You could throw in some bacon, you could throw in some cheddar cheese chunks, some onion. You can really flavor this however you want. I'm going to make mine plain. Like I said, I am going to throw it next to some chili that I have cooking. Preheat your oven to 375. Now that we have our oven preheated and our dough mixed, we are just gonna take some spray oil and spray our bread pan. Now we are just going to take our bread dough and put it into the baking dish. It doesn't have to be pretty. I like that it's kind of rustic looking. And we'll just flatten it out so it fills the bread pan. And then we are going to take a half a cup of melted butter and pour it over the top. All right, there we go. Once your oven is preheated, we're gonna stick it in for one hour. Let's take a peek. It has about a half hour to go. looking great it smells good in here okay you guys my timer just went off let's take the bread out of the oven it smells so good in here Ooh, look look at how brown oh it smells fabulous okay we have to let it cool before we can cut into it you guys, I took the bread out of the oven and it has cooled. Look how golden brown it got on all sides. Let's cut into it and give it a taste test. It's a little bit warm to the touch yet. And this is a very um, dense bread, which is exactly what I wanted the dense bread for the chili. That is what the inside looks like. Put some butter on it. And we'll give her a taste. Here we go. Mmm. It's crunchy. It is crunchy and light and fluffy. Mm. This part is super crisp. And then this part is like fluffy and light. And you can taste 
the yeast from the beer. You guys, it's so good. This is a winner recipe. I will link the recipe in the descriptions. Thank you guys for hanging out with me today in my kitchen. I hope you have a great day. Until next time, take care, friends.